Dale Jr. is just praying he is close enough behind Kurt. It's tough because he is pulled away from Green, so he doesn't have a lot of help behind him. And the four cars in front of him, mostly single file with Gordon in the lead. Didn't want to pull out that early on Jeff Green, but I think he is close enough. He is definitely in the draft of Kurt Busch and a big run through one and two. Races on with the top five. Two rookies in the top three. Kurt Busch, the defending 0-4 champ, is up here as well. Junior to the outside, in line behind Bliss. It's going to give him a big bump draft going into turn three. Edwards with a block on the zero. He gets stalled out. Junior down to block Kurt Busch, and he's up to third as he gets around the zero of Bliss, who had to lift after Edwards blocked him on the outside. Seven laps to go, this time by for Jeff Gordon, trying to replicate history and win the Aaron's 499 at Talladega in this 05 season like he did in real life. Oddly enough, he started second in that race, and he started second today. History may be on the side with Gordon. Can Bliss and Bush hang on? Can the Roush cars of Edwards and Bush work together to at least get one of those two in victory lane? Kurt hasn't won yet this year. Edwards looks low. Gordon goes down to block the 99. Junior to the outside of the 99 of Carl Edwards now. In line behind Jeff Gordon. He shoves him down to the bottom. Gordon got it just a hair loose in the middle of the corner and Junior somehow fit his car between the 99 and the 24. Trying to side draft Gordon, but Gordon's clear. The lead again with six to go at the line. They could be racing to a caution. They could be racing to the checkered flag. It is time to go. Junior aggressively hanging on the left rear corner panel of Jeff Gordon. Trying to run him up the hill. Contact, Gordon's in the wall. Here comes Edwards to the inside. Earnhardt has moved Gordon, and he blocks Edwards for the lead on the back straightaway. My heart is pounding right now. I'm sure your guys' probably is too. Mike Bliss got up to third. Gordon still in the lead pack. More cars closing in from behind. Some a lap down, some on the lead lap. Mike Bliss potentially looking to the outside. He goes down to side draft the eight of Dale Jr. And Bliss will lead this lap at the line with five to go. Three cars on the bottom right now, two up high. We saw the big one with five to go in the Daytona 500 earlier this season. Junior trying to squeeze Carl Edwards. Can't wait for the right moment though because if a caution comes out, the race is going to end this late. Four to go. You don't want to wait till the last lap because it may be too late if we don't even get to the last lap. Junior's going to clear Bliss into turn one with four to go for the lead again. Clear up high. Kurt Busch to the inside. Junior going to try to side draft the 97. Not clear yet is Kurt. Junior way down the track trying to pinch Kurt Busch on the inside. They rub fenders. Not a lot of help for Kurt down low. But he will get the advantage off turn four. And as they go back into the trioval, Dale Jr. pulls to the inside of Kurt Busch. At the line this time really close to call. I think Junior led that lap. Three to go. We could have the closest finish in channel history the way this is shaping up. Up high trying to side draft Kurt Busch. Gordon to the bottom. Carl Edwards in the middle. Junior sees that. Junior gets blocked though by Kurt Busch. Gave Bush a shot going into turn number three. 
Gordon hugging the apron down on the bottom. Can he clear Kurt Busch off turn four? He's trying to, but Kurt stays alongside of the 24. Earnhardt to the bottom. Gordon clears the 97, but Junior leads this lap by about a half a car length over Gordon on the bottom of the racetrack with two laps to go. If they get to the white flag, there will be no cautions on the final lap. Junior up high, trying to block Jeff Gordon. And again, it's Bush down low, who's clear of everybody off turn two, but he does not go to the outside to block Dale Jr. Surprised he didn't do that. Junior again down the track, side drafts Kurt Bush. Into turn three, the Roush cars are working together on the inside. Edwards is there, but Junior is going to break him up. They'll be coming to the white flag, 2.66 miles away from the checker and a win at the end of a 500 mile Talladega race. 10 cautions through all, it's gonna end under green. Earnhardt on the inside of Bush, side by side. Edwards trying to go for his third win in his rookie season. He goes to the bottom. He doesn't get underneath of Dale Jr. though. Bush clear on the back straightaway. Earnhardt trying to get a last surge of momentum as they go into turn three. Edwards can't go with his teammate up high because Gordon is above him. Junior is going to clear Kurt Busch through three and four. Can he hold clear off the exit of the corner? Here they come to the stripe. All the way to the finish. Three wide at the line. It is going to be Earnhardt. Oh my goodness. Dale Jr. is going to win at Talladega. Wow. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> The Roush Fenway sandwich was not enough to conquer DEI at Talladega. That has to be the closest finish in channel history. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I didn't I didn't know who won. When I first instantly hit the line, I was waiting for the scroll to come across on the bottom, and sure enough, we were the one that won it. Oh my goodness. I'll say tied to a three-way tie? I mean, <laughs> I don't even know who finished second. Oh my, have you ever, yes. Chris Ditch Schmidt, welcome to the stream. Toxic Punk, young boy, welcome. See in the chat? The original cars photo finish replicated. Yeah, we stuck our tongue out to win this race. I'm glad that ended under green. Unbelievable. And they didn't have to wreck the field to do it. I'm, I'm gonna burn it down. Fourth win of the season, back to back for Dale Jr. And he has won three of the last four. I don't think we're ever gonna have a finish like that ever again. That was insane. Get Mike Joy on the phone. Oh my goodness. I can't keep a smile off my face right now. That was insane. I'm shaking almost. Wow. There's got to be a replay of that. Margin of victory one one thousandth of a second. And Carl Edwards finished second. Kurt Busch, who led going into turn three, finishes third. Closest finish in NASCAR history in the Cup Series. Oh my goodness. After three hours, 34 minutes, don't have a heart attack. <laughs> I don't plan on it. Oh my goodness, 40 lead changes. We didn't even have the big one. We had 10 cautions for 30 caution laps, but... 
Wow! I feel like Trevor Bain when he won the Daytona 500. Oh, what? I don't even know where to go. Badger is zero, zero, zero. I don't know if the video game could actually like show that as a finish though. That is, un we gotta find a replay of that. It's probably gonna be the very, very end of it on the highlight reel. Cause we can't go back lap by lap, but on this game. Junior Nation. Junior wins another race at Talladega for DEI. <laughs> wow, I mean, what? if you're going to have a last lap pass, that's the way to get it done right there. Unbelievable, man. I just, I am still just as shocked now as I was like three minutes ago whenever it was that we finished. We still got to look at the top finishers. We got to look at how the points shape out. Another 1-2 finish for Earnhardt and Edwards. Back-to-back -back races. I'll go back to the high re highlight reel before I check out the rest of the finishing results. Oh, that, was, that wasn't that was when I was Dale Jr. That was uh, with Michael Waltrip. I think that was the finish right there. It was highlight two. Oh, there's only two of them. Yeah, so the second one... That was wild. Yeah, that was when I was racing as Waltrip, though. Uh, not Dale Jr. This was the finish. I wish we had a better... I didn't realize I was moving around that much. I was just trying to side draft as many cars as possible, really. I wish we had a better camera angle of it. That's all we have, but I mean, that was the, that was the finish. I thought when it instantly happened, I don't know who won, but I thought Kurt Busch and I would have been 1-2. I didn't think Edwards would have ended up second. But that's how close it was. I mean, one one-thousandth of a second. That is insane. I mean, the top three had to have been within a couple thousandths of a second. 